Hello everyone, let's see how to do diagnosis to worship in tuber process. Let us understand present to TB and present to drug resistant tuber process. Present to tuber refers to a person with any of the signs and symptoms suggested of tuber process. Where present to drug resistant TB refers to a patient who is eligible for reformation resistance screening at the time of diagnosis or and, and during treatment for drug sensitive TB or isonazid mono or poly drug resistant tuber process. Universal drug uh, sensitive testing. It refers to universal access to rapid drug sensitive testing for at least rifampicin and further drug DHT for at least prognosis among all TB patients with rifampicin resistance, preferably before initiation of treatment to maximum within 15 days of diagnosis. The first line TB drug, this is an urgent used agent, agent used to treat a drug susceptible TB such as rifampicin, isonazid, etamidol, and paragonimab. It may also be used in multi drug resistant tuberculosis regimens. Second TB drug, this is an agent result for, for the treatment of drug resistant tuberculosis. Bacteriological confirmed TB, T, that is referred to TB diagnosis in a biological specimen by smear microscopy, culture, or any WHO endorsed rapid molecular test and adopted by national tuberculosis elimination program such as gene expert MTB or RIF or TRUNET. Drug susceptibility testing refers to in vitro testing using the phenotypic method to determine susceptibility. The drug resistance testing refers to in vitro testing using genotypic methods such as multiple techniques to determine resistance. Now let us understand definitions. Drug sensitive TB. A TB is it refers to a TB patient whose biological specimen is not resistant to isonazid and rifampicin. While monoresistant tuberculosis is a, uh, is a patient whose biological specimen is resistant to one first line anti TB drug only. Isonazid and resistant tuberculosis is a, is a TB patient whose biological specimen is resistant to isonazid and susceptible to rifampicin has been compounded. Polydrug resistant tuberculosis is, uh, is refers to resistance to more than first line in, uh, first line, more than one first line anti TB drug other than isonazide and rifampicin. While rifampicin resistant TB is uh, refers to resistance to rifampicin detected using either phenotypic or genotypic method with or without resistance to other anti tuberculosis drug. So that is that is all about the definitions of uh, to various forms of tuberculosis resistance. Then we have, have multi resistant tuberculosis refers to a TB patient whose biological specimen resistant to both isonazide and rifampicin with or without resistance to other first line anti tuberculosis drugs. Pre extensive drug resistant tuberculosis, uh, the pre exit TB refers to a TB caused by mycobacterial tuberculosis stains that fulfill the definition of MDR or RRTB and are also resistant to any chloroquinol. While extensive drug resistant tuberculosis, that is exit TB, is caused by mycobacterial tuberculosis stains that fulfill the definition of MDR or RRTB and are resistant to any fluorocanol, leoproxacin or moxifloxacin and at least one additional group A drug present to either betaclin or lethal or both. What is the vision of case findings under uh, National Tumor Question Elimination Program? To, it, is, it is to provide early diagnosis to all the persons with signs and symptoms of of tuberculosis. Then to provide early diagnosis to all the persons with any form of drug resistant tuberculosis to universal access to drug sensitivity testing. Let us understand the methods for diagnosis, TB diagnosis. One is mere microscopy, then expert, gene expert TB, MTB or RIF, then true net MTB, then culture and radiography. Smear microscopy refers to urine staining or fluorescent staining is simple and cost effective. Gene expert MTB it is a cartridge-based nucleic acid amplification test. It helps in the simultaneous detection of both tuberculosis and rifampicin resistance. True net MTB is a chip-based micro real-time PCR-based uh, NAT, that is nucleic acid amplification test. It is a point of care test used for the diagnosis of tuberculosis. Culture is uh, it can be either solid culture or liquid culture. It, however, the issue is that there is a longer turnaround time. Chest X-ray should be used wherever possible among radiology or imaging methodology. It increases the sensitivity of the diagnostic algorithm. Genes for MTB is a cartridge with uh, CBNAT. It helps in simultaneous detection of the viruses and reformation in TB. Genes for MTB is follow is a follow-on test to molecular test. It detects the resistance to isonazide, uh, fluoroquinol, and second line uh, drugs. Tunat is a cheap based uh, NAT. It comes under, uh, uh, you know, duo and quattro, but point, it's a point of care test. That is a single, single, single model, double model, or four models. Line probase is a PCR and reverse hybridization uh, principle based method. Uh, method. It is interpretation based on development or absence of wild tap and uh, and non wild type brands. Solid culture is a discontinued now because because of longer time, line time, uh, Lawrence Jensen slope, that is LG slope, is inoculated as a 
backup for every midget culture now. Liquid culture, the DSP is used for the first and second and TB talks, and month it helps in the monitoring of treatment response. Let us understand the, pre the present TB patient. Smear exam smear examination done, chest X-ray is done, based on smear, smear positive and chest X-ray positive TB, it is confirmed as microbiology confirmed TB. If it is smear negative or chest X-ray suggests to, if it is smear negative or not available, chest X-ray not suggest to, then based on the clinical suspension, uh, the nucleic acid amplification test is initiated. And if it is positive, the MTB is detected, then it is microbiology confirmed TB. If MTB is not detected, then, uh, then consider alternate diagnosis based on clinical, clinical suspicion. If it is presumed, if presumed to pediatric uh, TB tuberculosis, and then based on CBNAT, uh, if it is MTB is detected, then it is called it is a microbiology confirmed tuberculosis case. case. If, if it is MTB is not detected, then based on chest X ray and tuberculosis and skin test. Uh, X-ray is highly suggestive, then gastric aspirin is corrected, CBNet is done, and based on if it is positive, this microbiology will come from tuberculosis, if it is negative, then consider alternate diagnosis. If chest X-ray shows uh, some, uh, some signs, and if the uh, TST is negative, then give the course of antibiotics. If chest X-ray is normal, TST is positive, you are it for extra primary tuberculosis. If chest X-ray is normal, TST is negative, look for alternate diagnosis. So we have here in we are integrated the drug and tuberculosis diagnosis and treatment algorithm. We have uh, the algorithm refers to all presumptive tuberculosis uh, management, all TB patients, and all the non-responders. You can refer to the ICMR guidelines for the details. What are the note on our extra parameter samples? All few extra parameter samples can be processed in CBNAT in the periphery. However, extra parameter TB samples such as lung tissue biopsy and lung lymph nodes require homogenization. It is to be performed in TB containment facilities such as uh, National Reference Lab or Intermediate Reference Lab and uh, culture and, and uh, drug and sensor testing labs. High volume samples such as gastric lavage, aspirate may be need to be considered by centrifugation for obtaining wild results. Processing bowel or pure fluid and peritoneal fluid in net requires biosafe centrifugation available only at laboratories with TB containment facilities. No attempts will be made to perform aerosol generating processes such as centrifugation and homogenization in the labs. Precious samples such as, F, 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 such as uh, F, F, FNC and CSF also can be processed at the peripheral. Um, it may be as good to laboratories with TB containment facility. CSF must be processed as quickly as possible. Samples must not be collected in fast. What is the definition of drug resistant tuberculosis? For confirmed drug resistant tuberculosis, DHT is suggesting drug resistance from are from a national tuberculosis intervention program called TSO CMDDST lab and there are by NTP industry testing method. Probable drug resistant tuberculosis refers to children with signs and symptoms of active TB disease, close contacts with a known case or close contact with a person who died of tuberculosis, close contact with a person who failed TB treatment and other such uh, uh, criteria. Here again we will present the algorithm approach to diagnosis of drug resistant tuberculosis in children, childhood TB patients uh, based on drug resistance, no, no, confirm it is a drug sensitive TB or drug resistant TB. Uh, and con if it is in contact with an infected TB patient, yes, then it sources it sources the drug resistant tuberculosis, consult the pediatrician. If still no information resistance, then treat according to the drug sensitivity of the source case. If the contact with the infected TB patient is present and drug sensitive to tuberculosis uh, is the case of the source patient, then do drug sensitive testing of the source. And if there is a, a poor response to treatment, then uh, consult the pediatrician. In chest X-ray, the advantages is that it has a widespread availability, low dose radiation, cost effective. This advantage is that it's a poor intra and inter observer agreement, poor sensitivity and specificity. When available, chest X-ray should be used as a screening tool to increase sensitivity of the diagnostic algorithm. Diagnosis of TB based on X-ray will be termed as clinical diagnosis, diagnosed TB process. The other diagnosis test available for tuberculosis includes tuberculin skin test or mount to skin test. It is a complementary test in children in combination with microbiology investigation, history of contact, radiology, and symptoms. TB blood test includes interferon gamma release assay, which is used in low prevalence countries to detect TB infection. Exact advantage of this test in high burden countries like India is not still not clear, is not recommended for using adults in diagnostic algorithm for TB in India. The commercial available kits are, uh, are present such as Contiferin TB Gold or TB Spot TB test. If it is a positive, say positive EGRA, then person infected with TB bacteria. Addition tests are needed to determine the person has latent TB infection. Negative EGRA, the person but did not react to the test and that latent TB infection of TB is not likely. 